Alright guys, yeah, I just thought I'd make another video, like I just recently picked up um, Crisis Core, uh, Final Fantasy 7 Reunion, like, um, just thought I'd make a video on it, like, um, I played uh, Final Fantasy 7 there um, last year, I really loved, really loved that game, generally a fan of uh, Final Fantasy games, or Square Enix games, yeah, I just thought I'd, um, Make a video on it, like I think I'm just early on in the game. Um, I was just doing a couple of couple of missions, but I'm really really enjoying it so far. Did you pick the game up yourself? Yeah, so I'm kind of in um, Shinra headquarters right now. But um, yeah, I was watching the trailers and stuff like that, and I was I, I was loving it. Like, but I was kind of looking at like, going, are the graphics good? Or like, or um, but I, I I think from seeing the game, I think graphics are unbelievable. Like, um, I don't know, just for some reason, that I saw a trailer and it looked like I don't know, like to me, kind of just for a second, it looked like a like a PlayStation Two game. <laughs> But I'm just nitpicking, but um, I think it looks incredible, like, incredible. Yeah, so I'm still doing missions here. I finished, I finished this one, this tree one, and it was fairly difficult, so four might be a bit... Um, I could try it, though. Tree was fairly difficult. I kept um, healing a lot, but um, I could try this one. Yeah, I like the way there's different different sort of outdoor areas, but um, yeah, right now I think I'm level um, 11, I think. Yeah, level 11, and I've just been in. As I say, doing those missions and trying to level up as much as possible. And my equipment is I have fire, blizzard, cure, and a blizzard blade as well. They've they've leveled up to full, and then I just have the fire one to do. I didn't play the gate this the original game back in the day. I believe it was like a PSP game or something like that. Like, but um, but yeah, very much looking forward to forward to this. Um, there's going to be some enemies around here. here here's, the, here's a chest. Yeah, so I've got a potion there. I'll just... I want to see... There's a shop so you can buy... Um, you can buy potions. <clears throat> just from the menu. So five, I might as well just buy another, uh, buy another three of them. So I'll just see how I get on in, in, um, in this mission. Activating combat mode. Yeah, so you can block with R1 and you, you can dodge your all. Oh, it's done there. And you can, um, you can dodge your all and attack is just square and you can sort of combo into, um, there's my um, blizzard blade. If you get behind the enemy as well, um, you can do a critical strike from behind like that. That does more damage. And you got some magic as well. Yeah, you just gotta be careful to uh, heal, but... The big thing is the, um, the, uh... Is the, um, the numbers at the side there, top, top left. It's like a slot machine, and you get some bonuses as you go.
Yeah, so I beat, beat those thankfully. Well, you can see that in the top uh, top right there, you can see the different chests that are in this area. So there's another chest to go, but um, you can see that they brought me down to very little health very quickly. So, but I'll keep, I'll keep going. Um, I have this guy as well. Gonna try this guy, and there's actually two of them when when you go to fight him. What's down here? No, it's another another area. But there's the other chest. So it isn't, isn't just the one guy. I believe there's two of them when you actually um, start the battle. But okay, got a high potion. That's good. So let's. Try this guy out. Activating combat mode. Oh, it's just one guy. Whoa! Killed me in one hit. Let's try again. Activating combat mode. Okay, gotta be careful. Stay behind them for as long as possible. Yeah. Hmm. I'll try one more time. I think I may have to level up a bit and then come back. Yeah, I don't want to uh, change any of my equipment because they're quite leveled up at the moment. Um, I'm wearing the bulletproof breast, which gives me good um, vitality. Yeah, if I equip that, I'll lose my, my vitality, so I don't really want to do that. But, um... I'll try one more time. I don't think I'll be able to beat this guy. No. No, I'll abort that. I'll come back, to, I'll come back in a later date. I need to just level up a bit, a bit more. I'll try a different mission. Um, yeah, see that's level one, so your battle with the summon made for valuable data. I've used this data to create a new battle sim. Be my guest and try it if you're up to it. Must but I must warn you though, it is only a simulation, the damage you receive will be very real. Um, I'll try this out. It's only it's only rank one. I believe one of these is uh, a sun. Oh, okay, so I have a different name. Okay, so, yeah, best to kind of, if I can, 
No. See if you take all those bars out, he, he won't do the he won't do his big move, but I am blocking times, so that's gonna I'm gonna get hit by this. So that did a bit of damage. I think the cutscenes are cool. So I took, took him out. Yeah, one of the missions was it said you could unlock his summon if you beat him. So I don't know if, the, if it was that that mission, but um, I just quickly save. Try this one out here. It's a rank one as well. Closed mine, closed coal mines. We have obtained information on monsters dwelling in closed coal mines. There is a possibility that the mines were shut off, for, shut off with precious items still inside. Please go investigate. Get Phoenix down for this one. And there's um, there's a crate in it as well. You can see from that that logo. Yeah, so let's uh, try this one out. But like how, I like how the, uh, the different um, areas are like, like Hojo's lab and stuff. There's there's a crate there. Yeah. Okay, so we have some new enemies here. And they become a, okay. Poisons. Um, I have an either or remedy, I'll use the remedy. Okay. All the time you have these slot machine slots just to the top top left and it gives you gives you bonuses, so it's cool to see that like so this is kinda of like a new area that I haven't been to, but um I'm just gonna quickly check my um My items. I'm gonna buy another two. I'm gonna buy two remedies. 
this case those monsters uh, poison me again. There's have some new enemies here. It's good to try and roll behind them because you get um see so you can see the Sephiroth, I got the I got a Sephiroth bonus. It, it uh, powers me up a little bit, I got I got boosts. You can check these pods every now and again to give you free items, but um, uh, I guess one one downside, one one thing that might put people off is is um, Zach's sort of general personality. He sort of has a really cocky sort of attitude, but I um, I don't mind it at all. I, I kind of I, I, I dig it, you know. Like it sort of reminds me of a little bit of well, not exactly like Titus, maybe a little bit, but. Um, But uh, yeah, I'm gonna just keep trying to do these missions. It's just a good idea, it levels you up. I've got another one here, it's just rank 2, so I should be okay with this one. You get ch Chocobo Armlet though, nice. We've obtained information on monsters living on a desert island. You may also be able to find some items out there. Please go investigate. So I'll try this one. Right in this in this area, so I wanna just here. Nice. I'm gonna lick her. So okay, so we have these items. What are these? What are these things? Springs. This block as well. Yeah, you do more damage from behind, so it's got idea to get behind. They poison. Nice. Okay. Up there. That's a nice view though, that's a cool view. It's like a beach area. That's dead. Oh, I have winged item, winged uh, creatures. Activating combat out of the way. Okay. This is a new enemy, but. Yeah, so just thought I'd make a, make a quick 
quick video like so far I'm liking the game maybe I'll do maybe I'll do more videos but um thanks very much for watching if you did definitely consider liking the video it definitely helped me out and just look forward for more more videos thanks very much for watching and see you next time see you then bye